In this lesson, we can learn about dialog box and tag span. While we already have lot of options available in the ribbons and tabs, if you think that you would need more controls for a particular features, then there are two ways to you can go about it. First is dialog box. For example, if I'm the home tab, I want to get more control over the font property. Then I can click on dialog box launcher because you have very limited commands over here, right? If you want to expand and we can go for further commands or tools, you just click on this. As soon as I click on it, it opens the format cells dialog box. Under that, you can see a number of options within respective categories like numbers, alignment, font, border, fill, protections, right? And also this would have a lot more options as compared to the ribbons tab. Because this is the entire range of options that is available to a user to perform these actions within the format cell preview. Similar way, for example, if I want to talk about alignment or number tools, just click on this dialog box launcher. You can see a number of options like this, right? So each of these groups, which is under respective tabs, you can use the dialog box launch to display the dialog box. Okay. And another important feature in Excel, which was introduced in 2013 version is Excel tab spans. For example, insert one picture, go to insert, instructions, pictures and this device that means from my system i'm just selecting this my adapt once you select these pictures just right click on your mouse you can see last option is called format pictures as soon as i click on this one windows appear that's called task pants and from here you can amend these pictures however you want for example if you want to show some shadows just select this and click on this shadow and transparency level you can adjust like this and size also you can increase and if you want to make it 3D format, just click on the 3D format and just select in the top level section and make it like this. However you want, you can make it. So this is the purpose of tag span. That means once you select the pictures, based on your comment, you can format however you want. Okay. And this will give you more control and more flexibility while working with options. Okay. So hope you clear this topic and let's move to the next lesson.